Hello YouTube and welcome to another one of my videos and today we're going to be talking about how to change your deck, how to make your deck bigger, in ways, on an easier way to find items in the bazaar. So first thing, um, first thing, you want to make sure you see your deck here. So one way to tell that your deck, to get it bigger, is you see max spells. You can only have 14. You can only have max copies of each spell. And you can only have five treasure cards. Okay? So. I already set up my deck to try to make it like some of the worst because this is the deck they give you to start out with. So this is the deck they give you to start out with. Um, okay, so first thing we're going to go to Bazaar and you want to press the deck button. It's going to be the last button. Do not press this yet. So when you're finding a new deck, this is the easy way. You press level and then you press school. When you press this, you find every deck for your school that is available in the bazaar because there's some decks you cannot buy in the bazaar but now we're going to buy this one um so decks when you buy them they're in sets of five 15 20 25 35 i mean there's some at 73 um but basic you basically like, most likely going to be buying the ones so sets of five every five levels so let's say you're level eight and you want a bigger deck you won't be able to get one Unless you get level 10, I mean, there's, there, I know where to buy level 10 decks, I'll show you in a minute. But, basically, when you get the new deck for your level, that's available. It'll say max spells 30, max copies 3, max balance copies for your school is 4. And the sideboard, you can have 11 treasure cards. So that's how you can tell whether the deck is going to be bigger. So I'm going to buy this one, just, just going to buy one. So you want to go to your book bag. Your, or your book, spell book, then you're gonna um, map back. So you have your starter deck, and then you have your new deck. So, in your new deck, as you can see, there's not enough space, and you may be a high level, you wanna add some more, you know, like a lot. Yeah, and then, so this is what you do you unequip this one, and put on this one, then you're all set. You got your new deck, it's way bigger. You can have a lot of your cards, see? You can have four of your cards, but any other school, it's going to be three. Because it's not your school. Any other school is going to be three. So that's like make your deck bigger, you have a bigger treasure card slot. So that's how you make your deck bigger, basically. But in the bazaar, it may be harder to find items. Like, let's say, um, equipment, basically. So let's say you don't have crowns to buy any crown equipment and you want to buy some regular equipment. So no one wants to scroll through all of this. This is 106 pages. You'd be here for literally an hour because people are just going to keep adding and adding and adding. So this is what you do. Level. School. And there you go. All of the clothes available for your school. With high level. See? You always look at the level slot. Because if it's red, you won't be able to get it, because it's, it's not your level. See? So like a level 20, you could buy this. I actually like that. I'm gonna get that. I know, this is so off topic, but I want that, so I'm gonna sell this. So again, I'm gonna show you how to work this so level. It's cool. Okay, it's gone now, I think. Oh, there it is. Okay. So then I just bought something for my school and my level. So I didn't have to go through all of the changing and... Wait, let's move the person again. So I don't have to go through just looking at that. Like, everything's out of place. Another thing I want to show you guys is... Um, it's a valuable way to use your training points. And where to buy the level 10 decks. So at level 12, you go to the, I'll show you. You can only revoke all your training points at level 12, okay? So I'm going to show you where. 
because this is useful advice because some people like my secondary school storm and I know you may like that but upper in the game it's gonna get harder and you can't use those things so at level 12 you come to this guy and you get all of your, you your book your character and you get your training points you see this when you do get your training points this is what you guys need to do the first thing you should buy is this you should buy tower shield the main thing if you're any school other than life and death you need tower shields I don't have Seder because balance has a heal so you don't need it but you're gonna need tower shields Seder and faint those are your mains these you're gonna these are actually a must also but you'll get these later in soul stuff but the main ones you need is faint tower shield and Seder which I don't need because balance has this heal I'm right there this has its own heal then where to get the level 10 decks so um level 10 is kind of a major step because you could start tourneys it's not as major but it's really useful so this is where you go um we're gonna go here shopping district there's little shops that no one really goes to but you can um I'm gonna go over here so there's the deck shop right here so you're gonna go in here and um, there's this guy, he's in the corner, I don't know why I said to the cash register, steal his money. Anyways, there's the decks for everyone's school. See, it doesn't have max school copies because you're only level 10. But the decks are not that expensive. See, I can't buy the one for my school. See, med school only. Their school, you can buy these two. This is level 5, you can come here and buy this level 5 one. That's the one you get, and then it, it, it gives you the one for your school at the top. So that's what you do. Um, also, if you want to sell crown items, crown plants, I'm trying to remember, there's someone you can go to, I think it's in Crocotopia, the housing um, guy on the Crocus Sphinx. You can go sell like your paint dandelions. Well, I can sell these if I don't want it. These can be like, if I don't want that. Because so, I really don't. I got it from like a job. Oh, I like that. I like the stars. So, um, that's that. Hopefully, that information was very useful. Because I've seen a video where he got 4,000 views, but he wasn't really useful at all. And people are like, this guy's useless. They need help. And I'm like, well, maybe if you need more useful tip videos, let me know. I'll be posting gaming, PvP, and, um, November 5th will be my live stream for um, the donations for Extra Life. So I hope you guys enjoy.